Hi, right, welcome everyone back to Let's Play War of the Human Tanks Alta. Last time, we had lots and lots of story plot, and we had a unwinnable battle. I went back in the battle with L. I've done it multiple times, even surviving the first salvo, but Albatross, as far as I'm aware, will auto evade. I haven't actually gotten close enough to see it. So. Our victory condition is to annihilate all enemy command tanks. I'm assuming Albatross is their only command tank. Notice this map is gigantic. So, what we're gonna do... Assemble... Um, where is it? Oh, here we go. Ray. It has a space ray. One, two, and three of those. Next up, we have these assault tanks. Tet uh, Tetre. I have no idea how to say that. We're gonna build four of these. L's uh, overhaul does. Oh, I guess I can't see. Uh, I actually wonder what L's overhaul does. I wonder if it makes it. I wonder if that's equivalent to the sniper scope. So like this thing never misses. I don't actually know. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put that there. This here. And this there. Now, if I remember, yes, Ruru... Okay, Ruru is still one tile. Right? Yes. Uh, put leggings on the field of battle. Albatross, you cannot block or evade. Albatross has attack. Okay. We may be attempting this more than one time. Just a heads up. So what are your guys' stats compared to this? So we're plus one move and plus one shooting range? Okay. Things we have deployed, we have 12. <laughs> and let's put a Kodama down for old times' sake. And then Yuku can go here and here. That's 16. <clears throat> I actually will not save here because of the supplies. I may not need three of these things. Final battle go.
Albatross is going to reach the capital. At this rate, we have to stop it here. We can't defend against or evade Albatross's attack. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna have to be careful. Power of Albatross. No, no human tanks. Unknown enemy destroyed modules. Okay, I still have these. So I guess if I was using other modules other than these set ones, they'd be fried. Joke's on you, I don't use any. I think our first move here, yes, is speed 4. What are these things, speed? Oh, they're speed 2, nice. We have this. Firing hard. Let me, uh, this Let's fire there. Good. Oh boy. We have fun and pain. Alright, let's start on this side. It's a shock tank. Let's fry this. We got a scout. Let's switch to this side real quick. Yep, bomb. Uh, I won't be able to get the bomb without. Actually, I will. The, the We're gonna move this one next. Okay, there was an evade there. We'll have to keep that in mind. So <laughs> There was snipers dead. Another evade. Salt tank dead. We are dominating, but they are returning fire. Let's put a shot up the middle here. When Albatross fires, as we saw in the last episode, we're gonna take quite a few casualties. Ooh, we ended up getting one of those. There was an evade there. Can Ruru hit that from here? No. Here we go. <laughs> oh, yes. Let's start from this side. Open fire! Something evaded. Evaded. Evaded! What is happening? <laughs> I 
was that Albatross dodging everything? Oh, that's bad. Okay, good. It didn't have the reach to barbecue Ruru. -Ru. Let's have Ruru -Ru take care of that for you, shall we? What? Ruru? Ruru? Unknown enemy deployed her special weapon. Yeah, okay, yeah, an enemy sniper is dead. Something exploded. This is definitely the largest fire area I've ever seen in this game. Oops, something exploded. There is an evade. Ooh, a four tile assault's dead. Oh, there's six tile artillery. It's fried. That will happen. Alright, we got a we got a scout tank who's being sneaky. Uh, I can't quite reach anything worth. Get this thing going. Oh yes. Dude. More of it. Something exploded. More snipers. Oh, hey, it's a sniper. Enemy Nagasa. Nagasa? I didn't read that fast enough. Log. Emmy Nagisa sighted. Okay. Let's get Kodama rolling. Uh, I want to get this side rolling now. I think we've barbecued everything in this area. I think it's just Albatross. Well, why could Albatross be 31% of the enemy army? Actually, that, that's a terrifying thought. Oh! There's a Kodama there! What? Hold on. You've got a shadow cutter? You have a shadow cutter mantlet. All their Kodamas have shadow cutters. I needed more snipers. Kill this Kodam. Koko 
Alpha. Well, at least that thing's dead. Kill that. <laughs> Your dodge hacks. Uh, who moves first on this side? That one's almost ready. Okay, we have an artillery ready to go. Hi. Oh, the interceptor can't hurt. I wonder if that module prevents my uh, my stuff from being intercepted. Cause that'd be cool. Actually, I'm gonna. Uh, I guess I do need to move this forward. Actually, that was dumb. Cause now that guy can't get forward. Covering fire. What, you can intercept from there? <laughs> well, I guess these missiles... I don't know what that module does. It's your intercept range. Uses me greatly. <laughs> Good job killing your only effective yeah. interceptor. Yeah. That was funny. I know I'm just asking for them to get killed, but... Eh. Alright, let's fire over here. I got this. Clearly there's something over there. See if we can pull this off. Are we doing damage to it at least? Yes. Hey, you. <laughs> I would like it if you don't do that the whole time. Engage. I'm assuming Albatross is like right here. Did. Exploded. Exploded. Hit. 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 So we are damaging it. Oh boy!
I think you just barbecued your own unit. Just saying. Hold on, is that how big it is? That thing's gigantic. Yeah, you say you can't tell me he evaded that. So we took our first casualty. That thing's gigantic. Let's finish it off. That it? Or are you gonna evade? Yeah, it's dead. Enemy albatross fell silent. Lay down and die now, albatross. You've asserted your dominance for the last time. Enemy tank silent. <laughs> it's not impossible for the protagonist. It's what we do. I know. Now, why couldn't our uh, friend uh, Kurara with her elite force do that? I don't know why she couldn't do that. Massive victory. Yeah, Albatross is the command tank. We lost the one assault at the very end. Oh. Almost half a million credits right there. There's my refund for my one dead tank. The mesh of human tanks that made up Albatross's body began to break be began breaking down. February 28th evening. The experimental tank or the experimental imperial tank Albatross sustained critical damage. The human tanks it has simulated fell apart one after the other, letting out unheard cries. We did beat it. Yeah, Albatross is dead, and apparently that means so is your army. Albatross was the very incarnation of what Hungu considered an ideal tank. A weapon without a mind of its own, fulfilling its only purpose. Destruction. Perfection. Albatross is going to die. You could argue it was never truly alive, either, because it was just a mesh of tanks. A weapon that would never be betray was about to come to its end. Why was that so hard to read? Still moving. Ruru hit it again. I can't believe you missed with the cobalt rifle. This thing is about as persistent as Siren. Well, you're not that far off, Alter. Ruru? Yo, Kai. I'll do it. <laughs> oh yes, the railgun. L. Huh. Hi, Albatross. Don't you look familiar? Don't want die. Well, you're gonna die. Perhaps it was just her imagination. Or perhaps she could hear the cry of fellow tanks within the monstrosity in front of her eyes. That's nightmare fuel right there. <laughs> Once help. What is that tank? I haven't seen it before. It appears to be an Imperial tank. Oh, is this, uh... What Hashiko and Satao ended up finding? Did it escape from the Royal Engineering Bureau? Then it is the battery tank we've heard about? I'm sorry, everyone. 
Sorry I'm the only one who survived. It reached its limits, though. Get back. It's going to explode. <laughs> it can still be saved! There's more than one person talking. That must be Chiku. Go, men. I'm pretty sure that's sorry in Japanese. Might be Gomen Nas Nasai or something. Gomen Nasai? Yeah. It's irrelevant. I have, com I have a commander. I have to. Pull the trigger, L. You did it once. I will help. What? <laughs> the tank. This is what happens when you dumb down its mind, right? And you fuse it with intelligent, more intelligent human tanks. When it falls apart, right, one single tank, it'll fall back to the tank it was. <clears throat> so it's going to betray Hangu. <laughs> L.I. I see. Albatross is going to do the same thing to you as it did to Sasagusa. It's going to eat you. I will help Lieutenant Colonel. I see. Protect Lieutenant Colonel. Now it's going to implode. She was a human tank. She stood before her enemy to protect her superior. She became a shield, a wall for her. It's defending Hangu. Well, that was the case when it was all fused. It may not be the case now. Albatross. Yeah, you will protect the Lieutenant Colonel. Dying for their superiors fills them with happiness. Failing for their superior, falling for their superiors gives them joy. That is the instinct of human tanks. Your I think it's regained that ability. Are you going to betray it? Hangu? They can die for their superior. They will receive a pat on their head for their deeds. Did I read that right? <laughs> I don't think they'll get a pat on their head if they're dead. L? It's okay. I'm your human tank alter. Fire! I won't lose to it. Let's go together, Albatross. Yep, we won't lose, because we've got a rail gun. I cannot lose! Bolt that pierces the sky. February 28th. The Capital Defense Army, led by the, the Acting Queen, defeated the Imperial Army's Dreadnought class tank. The Fuji ambush operation ended in the Imperial Army's defeat. The Imperial Army immediately retreated back into Fuji's force after losing their main force and commander. So Elle not only barbecued Albatross, she barbecued Hun Hungu. A guerrilla war ensued in Fuji's force the following month. The acting queen participated in this battle as well, along with the human tanks who deeply respected her. When she raised her arm forward, the tanks rushed into battle without hesitation. 
They continue to fight. They were born for their beloved superior. To fight for their beloved superior. And die for their beloved superior. Akin to snow. And it will continue as so ever on. Until they can be of you. Until they can be of. Until they can be of use to their superiors on the battlefield, their battle will never end. Are you dead? <laughs> oh, hey, little altar is here. No. Alright, whoa. But I feel like I'm about to die. Huh. Let's see. I reckon. Your imperial tank. You're wearing a steel helmet. What are you doing here? <laughs> Nothing. I guess this is where she met Elle. Aren't you cold? <laughs> yes. Wanna come to my house? No, I can't be a burden. You won't be. Oh, but you're an Imperial tank. It's okay, it'll be fine. I'll protect you. Protect? It's supposed to be the other way around. Oh. Oh, she should come laughing and smiling. So funny. Yeah, I just said that. It's supposed to be the other way around. Human tanks are supposed to protect humans. That does, it indeed does not matter. Are you asleep? Oh, hey, it's real altar. Nope. The warm sunlight shining through the clouds melted away the snow at the edge of the forest. They stretch and brace themselves for the coming of spring. Great weather to sleep in. Eh, I guess so. Not sleeping. Alter, here's the here's the list of supplies. Oh, it's Bagumian. Vice Commander. Let's see. Didn't you leave for Kurabo's place yesterday? Before I forget. It. Yay! She's to Lieutenant Colonel again. Well, actually, is I think Lieutenant Colonel's above Major. That's probably the time it took for her to order a new one. Um... Did you do it again?! Second. You screwed it up again. Why? Grava sent me back again. Again? This time it was for ramen? So you ate it. This will never get over.
Yes. Good. No need to kneel. Over there. April 7th. The operation to wipe out all enemy forces within Fuji's force ended. Boot back Megumian. <laughs> oh, fun. <laughs> it is funny. Unless you're uh, Megumi. Booted back. Oh, Oh boy. Been a while since the last Ishidaki. Ishidaki. I will finally figure out how to say that. Alter. Yes. Where to next? Well, the Imperial Capital, why not? Her route seems to be facing trouble, so probably there next. Oh, the Tenryu Tunnel. Fun and pain. Their war has not ended. They will not stop fighting. Every fallen tank is another reason for her to fight. They continue to march through the barren plains, ready to face what awaits them. It is time. The call can be heard. Alter, it's time. Earlier than expected. Hello, Ruru. Can't be helped. All right. Then. Human tanks charge. So you're scene was extremely loud to you. It was to me, too. Obtain Tank L. You can create a clear save data. If you load this data, you can start a new game keeping your data. Save clear game data. Sure. Save it over Twilight Roar. Yes. Game saved. Okay, so we got a few things to look at. We got movie mode.
I looking at? Is this, is this the intro? Yeah. Oh, I see. It's the different voices for people. I got it. Oh, okay. Hold on. Alter opening. Oh yeah, in case you didn't get to see that, because I didn't upload. Oh! Hold on, is the, uh... Is the War of the Human Tanks opening here? Oh, it is! I know I didn't show the War of the Human Tanks intro in that one. In, in the uh, original Let's Play. How many versions of the opening is there? Let's look at the this last one here. So there you go. Those are the entrance to War of the Human Tanks. Uh... Oh, we get to look at the endings? Uh, I think I go North Ending A. I had to let you know. You really got to go. Let the music take you. Oh, 
Oh, it's just credits. It doesn't make sure. What a sound mode, though. Is this just all the music? Uh... There's all the instinct army. I'm trying to remember the one I'm looking for. These are sorted alphabetically, which... Here it is. Oh, anyway. Enough of me screwing around in these different modes that I've never seen before. This is the end of this episode of Let's Play War of the Human Tanks Altar. Next time, we'll probably uh, load our clear data and probably get to work on the cavern. I'll see you then.